everyone, so it is time for my last Ipsy vs. Birchbox for the year 2015. Today I'm sharing what I got inside my December bag and box. For those of you that are new to my channel or new to these videos, Ipsy and Birchbox are both $10 a month beauty subscription services. So you pay $10 each month and you get a bag or box delivered to your door with four to five samples, deluxe size samples, or full size products. And I like to share these unboxings with you guys so you can get an idea of what you would get if you were to get it. Some of them are individually based on your own beauty profile, but it's just fun to see what other people got and kind of compare and see if we got the same things or different things. So as always, don't forget to leave me a comment below letting me know what you guys got inside your bag or box or a link to your video so I can check it out. So let me show you guys what I got inside my birch box and then we will jump into Ipsy. And if you're not interested in birch box, then just skip to this timestamp to see what I got in my Ipsy bag. So the birch box this month is really cute. It is white and silver and then the back is lime green. I snapchatted a picture of it just because I thought it was so cute for winter. So let's see what's inside. Birchbox is running their $5 deal still. I think that it must be a permanent deal that they're just kind of renewing every single month. If you guys are interested in trying Birchbox, you can get your first one for $5, which is a great deal. That way, if you're curious about it, you only have to spend $5, and if you don't like it, you can cancel, but if you do like it, then you only spend $5. So I think it's a great deal either way, even if you only want to spend $5 and get it as a gift for someone, that way they can try it out. I think it would be a great idea. So I'll have the link and the coupon code in the description box below in case you guys are interested. So the first thing in here is by the brand Amika. I love their packaging. I think that it is so fun and pretty, but this is a nourishing mask with sea buckthorn berry in it. It's supposed to be intensely conditioning and repair all hair types. So I will definitely give this a shot. I love trying hair masks and as you guys can tell, I, well, since I talk about it in all my videos, I struggle with dry hair. So I feel like hair masks are one of my favorite things in the entire world and I can't wait to use this one. The next thing in here is a perfume and I actually just ordered a perfume off the Birchbox website because I sampled one and I really liked it but this is the Sincerely Scent by Harvey Prince. I have tried um, what is it? Harvey Prince Hello, I think is what it's called, and it smelled really nice. So let me see what this one smells like. This one is really strong. It's super florally, super fruity. It smells good, but I think it might be a little too intense for me. I think that it might be really nice during the spring or the summertime, but either way, I like getting fragrance samples because I do like to switch mine up every once in a while, so maybe I'll come back to this one in the spring or the summer and try it out then. The next thing in here, the packaging is so pretty. I feel like everything has just like really pretty packaging this month, but this is a Shea Butter Hand Cream. Ooh, I love hand creams. It's in the scent Green Tea. This is from the brand Soap and Paper Factory, so it's supposed to be super moisturizing so I will definitely use this. I feel like I've discovered so many good hand creams from Birchbox. I just did a video on my winter beauty essentials where I talked about a hand cream and I discovered that one from Birchbox as well. So I love this packaging. I think that it's so cute and this will just be great to throw in your bag. The next thing in here is from Coastal Scents. It is a Style Eyes eyeshadow sampler. I really like Coastal Scents eyeshadows because they are super pigmented and they are also really really affordable. It says that the full size eyeshadow palette is only $12 so I will definitely have to check it out especially because the two shades that I got are so pretty the first one is kind of like a silvery charcoal sparkly shade and then the other one is a dark kind of black with some silver in it so I cannot wait to wear these these are perfect for the holidays perfect for like a New Year's Eve smoky eye and I'm excited to play with them. the last thing in here is by Ico London it is their fat liquid eyeliner in the shade black I love liquid liners let's see Oh, this one is really fat. I wonder, that's probably why they call it that, but I'm curious to try this one out just because I normally use the Stila Stay All Day Liner and that one is super long and thin so it creates the perfect winged liner. So I feel like this one would be really hard to get winged liner with, but it might be really great if you are a big fan of like thick liner, just so you don't have to keep going over the same place over and over. I don't know. I will definitely use it and I'm just curious about it. So I'm excited that I got this. So that's everything I got in my Birchbox this month. They did send out a $10 off $35 coupon that I think they probably sent to everyone, which is a great kind of little extra. I do shop on the Birchbox shop a lot. I get a lot of water bottles from there. If you guys watch my Snapchat story, you know that I'm obsessed with water bottles and they just have good makeup on there. So that's everything I got. Let me know in the comments below what you guys got in your box and let's jump into Ipsy. So Ipsy actually sent 
sent a little extra, which was so nice of them. This is actually from Michelle Fawn, supposedly, but she was the one that started Ipsy, and it says, just thank you for being subscribed for over three years now. I actually was subscribed when they released their very first bag. I think that I canceled for a little while somewhere in between there, but for the most part, I've been with them since the beginning, so that was so nice of them. It is a Shade Play Artistic Eye Color Palette, and it is from the M brand. I've tried a few things from this brand, and I've always liked their products. Wow, this is really, really nice. So, oh wow, this is like super good quality. I've never tried one of her eyeshadow palettes, but it comes with six different eyeshadows. So I am so excited they sent this to me. It was a really, really nice extra that they didn't have to do, but I think it was nice that they care about their subscribers. This is what the bag looks like this month. It is super cute. It's kind of like this red patent bag, and I've never gotten one like this before, but I love it. I think that it is so festive for the holidays. So let's see what's inside. If you guys do want to sign up, I'll have a link in the description box below in case you guys are interested. But again, it is $10 a month. So the first thing in here is by the brand Acure and it is a cell stimulating facial mask. I love facial masks. They are probably, I don't know if it's facial masks or exfoliators. I love both of those equally but they're kind of like my favorite skincare products. So this is supposed to be, oh, a green sea monster mask. You spread it all over your face for 10 to 15 minutes and I don't know, I'll definitely try it out. It's supposed to kind of refresh and renew your skin. So I love trying new skincare products and I can't wait to use this one. The next thing in here is by the brand Formula X and it is a nail polish. I know that they sell these at Sephora, but I've never tried them. I need to get my nails done. I need to stop biting them. I'm having such a hard time, but I, I will kick the habit this year. So this is really pretty. It's in this rose gold shade in the shade Revved Up and this is definitely a shade I would wear. I think that it, again, it's perfect for the holiday for the new year and I can't wait to try it out. The next thing in here is by the brand Chlorine. I've actually tried their dry shampoo and it is amazing. It is one of my favorites and I think if you have like a sensitive scalp it's a really really great option. Anyways, this is their floral water. It's a makeup remover with soothing corn flour. Oh, and this one's actually great if you have sensitive, if you have sensitive skin or sensitive eyes, it says. So I love um, cleansing waters. I think that they're so great for removing your makeup. Cleansing waters and cleansing oils, they're just so gentle and they just do such a good job. So I will definitely use this one. I got a lipstick in here from the brand Pacifica. I've only tried their lotion, I believe, but it smells really good. So this is supposed to be a natural lipstick in the shade Nudie Red, and let's see what it looks like. Packaging is super cute. This is a Power of Love Powerful Lipstick. It has some like gold hearts on it, and it is in stick form. The shade looks like a pretty kind of nude shade. Oh, it's really, really pretty. It's kind of like a nude, but it has, it kind of looks like the shade that I'm wearing on my lips today. It's definitely something I would wear, and it looks like it has almost a matte finish to it, so I'm curious to try this out. I've never used any makeup products from this brand, so I can't wait to see how it works. And the last thing I got in here is a Thank Me Later eyeshadow primer by the brand Elizabeth Mott. That is a super, super cute name, but it comes in this pink packaging, which again is super cute. I think that I've tried an eyeshadow from this brand or a lipstick, but I can't remember how I liked it. So I love trying new eyeshadow primers. I will definitely give this a shot. And honestly, eyeshadow primers last forever. So this size will probably last me a few months. So I can't wait to use it. I feel like I got a really good Ipsy bag this month and I'm excited to try everything that I got. So don't forget to let me know in the comments below what you guys got in your Birch Box and Ipsy because I love hearing from you. I love hearing what you guys got. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch. I really appreciate it and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.